Do you have faith? How much thanks is in your tank? Are you sitting here with faith in Jesus that is yielding forgiveness for yourself and for others? One that lets go of the rear view mirror, just rips it right off and throws it out the window? Is your faith in Jesus producing reverent worship like the forgiven woman? Or are you coldly proper and unloving like the Pharisee? Is your faith in Jesus producing clarity and revelation? Can you see Jesus? And can you see others the way that God sees them? Or are you spiritually blinded and distracted by the past of others or your own past? Is your faith in Jesus producing humility or are you puffed up and dead set on pointing your fingers at others? And to what extent are you tarnishing their reputation to make yourself look bigger? And if so, why? But we all do it. This story teaches us that faith in Jesus produces gratitude that flows from a forgiven and purified heart. When we make the controversial claim that it is time for gratitude, it's a matter of the heart. What is going on in your heart today? Do you see yourself as truly forgiven? When we say it is a time for gratitude, it's a matter of worship. Are you responding reverently to the presence of God in your midst? When we say that it's a time for gratitude, it's a matter of clarity. Are you clear on who God is and what God is doing right here and right now? Or are you stuck on empty? When we challenge and say that it's time for gratitude, it's a matter of posture before God. Are you puffed up Pharisee? Are you irritated and impatient and put out? Or are you humble and spotless as a worshiper who's spending time at the feet of God? Simply put, I ask you to think of your heart as a tank of thanksgiving. How much thanks is in your tank?